Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Today I'm going to talk about lesson 37. I'm carrying most of the word more beautiful. Can you start? Ladies and gentlemen, today I want to talk about care. The biggest problem facing the world today is a lack of care. People only care about themselves, they don't care about other people. They don't care about their, in their family, they don't care about the environment, they don't care about their community. Worst of all, they don't care about their country. I am here to encourage you to start caring. We want to be treated fairly, we want to be loved, we want to be taken care of. We all need clean air to breathe, we all need clean water to drink, we all need green place to enjoy, we all share the same motherland. We all share the same emotions, let's do our right to start caring more. Lessons 38 Success is up to you. Ladies and gentlemen, if you want to be sure of success, you have to make sure that you study every day, that you improve yourself every day, that you progress every day, and that you work hard every day. Your success depends on your commitment. If you pour your heart and soul into what you do, you're sure to be successful. Lesson 96 Would you mind driving? Uh, hey Michael, I'm tired. Would you would you mind driving for a while? Sorry, I would I would like to, but I don't know how to drive. Really? You don't have a license? I thought everyone had a license. No, I have to, I live in the city. I live in the cities all my all my life. And uh, when I'm at home, I usually take the sub the subway or bus. I see. Do you think you will learn to drive in the future? Yes, I plan to. Uh, to buy a car next year. I think you need one in the US. Actually, now that I think about it, uh, a lot of people in the cities here take the bus also. Well, I, like to, I would like to travel more. I've been here uh, for a few months already and I feel like I haven't seen anything yet. How are you going to learn to drive? Do you want, to, do you want me to teach you? No, I would. I wouldn't want to ch to trouble you. I already set up a set up for a class near my house. to start next month. That's ninety-seven. Your English is so good, Thomas. Would you? Your English is is so good. How did you learn it? Well, in my country, everyone had to take English starting in the first grade. I've been taking English class for twelve years now. Wow, that's interesting. I remember when I when we took that trip last year and visited your family. It seemed like, like there wasn't many people that could speak with me in English. Of course, or that's because they don't speak English that much. But they but they speak in school, right? Maybe they just didn't like me so they didn't want to talk to me. No, actually they like you a lot. Uh, they told me they they thought you were very very nice. They are just shy. They're not used to talk to talking with foreigners. I I remember when I first came to the US. I was I was really nervous about speaking with people. I see. I thought there were there were lots of Americans teaching English in that country. Yes, that's true. They're probably uh, twice as many now as there were five years ago. But they are mostly in the cities, my family is in the country. I wonder why, personality, I prefer the country to see to the city. It's so quiet and peaceful. Uh, if I were to teach, I would want to teach in the country. Do you think you, you would want to teach uh, someday? I know the school around my town are looking for teachers. So if you want, I can, I can call them and get more information. No, I don't think so. I would need to stay there for a year, and I don't think I can take that much time off work. Well, if you change your mind, let me know. I think you, I think you would be really great teacher. That's all about my lesson. See you in my next video. Bye bye.